Chatty Chrissy. Yes, we love Chatty Chrissy. And I've had such fun this week putting together what I'm going to wear. So do you remember our first week we had, I am the light of the world. Do you remember? And today I've brought a very special torch, which doesn't only just shine at the top, but it shines at the side as well. So if you get lost, it can flash out or it can point where you need to go. So that's all about Jesus being the light. Last week, I hope you enjoyed making your picnic and your sandwiches. Can you remember what it was? It was Jesus saying, I am the bread of life. Well, today, huge hint. What are these? They're traffic lights. And Jesus said, not only I am the light of the world, whoop, turn it the right way round, come on, piece of paper. There's my light bulb. Not only I am the bread of life, but Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. How cool is that? Have you ever been lost? Well, you know, I am a disaster. I get lost wherever I go. I do. So here I am jiggling around, but I always get lost. And I went out two weeks ago with a friend of mine. We went on to Dartmoor and we went for a one hour walk and it was beautiful until we came through some bushes and it was really muddy. And I was just wearing my flip-flops, which wasn't very sensible. And the mud was up to our knees and we were going through this mud and it was so hard to see the direction we wanted to go because in front of us there were trees. So we knew we had to keep by the river. So we kept on walking along the river, but then it was impossible. So we had to scrabble up some rocks. My friend fell over. My flip-flops were getting stuck in the mud. And instead of it being a one hour walk, oh, it wasn't two, it wasn't three, it wasn't four, it wasn't five, it was a six hour walk in the mud because we had got lost. We had not followed the instructions. Now here, I brought a walkie talkie. So if you get lost, you can talk to someone and they can direct you. And on the radio, they can tell you how to go. And when we're going to school, we see the zebra crossings, don't we? And the zebra crossing says, it's safe to cross here. It's a road sign and the road sign tells us the way. Well, Jesus is saying that he's like the radio. So when we pray to God, it's like the radio going straight to God and say, can you please tell me where I should go? Can you please tell me how I should react? Can you please tell me how I should be? I don't want to be angry. Please help me. I don't want to feel lost inside. Please help me. I don't want to feel scared inside. Please help me. And God promises that his radio waves are never full and he always replies. Now he replies in one of three ways. And that's where our traffic lights come in. So red, as you know, means, what does it mean? Stop. And sometimes when we pray a prayer, God knows the big picture and he knows that wouldn't be good for us. So he says, no, I'm not going to do that because it wouldn't actually be good for you. Stop. Sometimes yellow or amber means we've got to wait, doesn't it? And get prepared. Sometimes when we ask God for things and he says, yes, but not now. So yes, I'm listening. Yes, I hear you. Yes, I know what's best for you, but not now. And sometimes it's green, and green is fun, because it's go, yes, hooray. It's what God wants for us, what we want for us. When it's red, it's a bit tough, because we have to listen, and we have to wait, and it's hard when someone says no to us. But God knows best. So Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. Now, if we want the best way in life, we need to always cross at the zebra crossing, don't we? If we cross on the road, we might get run over. And if we don't follow God's path, which is like crossing on the zebra crossing, then we can sometimes get ourselves into lots of trouble. 
Have you ever got in trouble at home? Maybe you've answered badly. Maybe you've told a lie. <gasps> Maybe you've stolen something. And you know it's not right, but you've done your own thing rather than doing what you know God wants you to. And so Jesus says, I am the way. I'm the way to know God. I'm the way that you can have peace in your heart, peace on the inside. I am truth. So God always tells the truth. And I give you life. Now, life, we're breathing, so that means we're alive. But it doesn't mean like that when you've got to pump on someone and go, <laughs> to get them breathing again. No, no, no. It's to give us something inside, which means we feel alive inside because we have a relationship with God. How cool is that? So, Jesus said, I am the light of the world. Jesus said, I am the bread of life. And then Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. Hooray! Now homework and your life. Oh no, Chrissy! But homework, well, we've got our special bunting, haven't we? And so we've got our I am. I am the light of the world. I am the bread of life. I hope you all managed to do that. And today... I would like you to draw a traffic light and I've put a compass here, a compass. You could draw a radio or something or a road, something that will remind you of Jesus saying, I am the way, the truth and life. So there's mine. I've got my traffic lights and my compass to show me the way. And this week we're going to send out some more packs and it says, Jesus said, I am the way. And you can colour this in and you can cut it out and stick it on your door. And that means either no entry or entry. And it also reminds us when we're going into our room that Jesus said, he is the way. How cool is that? And if you've got some cars at home, which I know loads of you do, I've got some cars at home. I would like you also to make a road track one bit of the road to come to a dead end, because that's like the no. One bit where you've got to go round and it feels like you're forever going round and that's the wait bit. And then one bit, which is a good bit, which gets you to the direction you want to go. Do you think you can do that? I'm sure you can. Bye bye. I am the light. I am the bread of life. And I am the way, the truth and life. What's it going to be next week? Woohoo!